Our products can vary in model style. While the model used in this video may not look exactly like your machine, the procedure demonstrated here is very similar. Always unplug the machine from the outlet before working around any moving or electrical components. If you need to use power while diagnosing an issue, please use caution. Remove the motor hood and place the walking deck in the storage position. Make certain that the storage latch is properly secured. Locate and remove the screws from the underside of the walking platform. Your treadmill most likely has eight. Refer to your user's manual for verification. Carefully lower the walking deck and remove the side rails. Remove the idler bolts. Remove the idler roller. While turning the drive roller by hand, pull on the inside of the drive belt in order to walk the drive belt off the drive roller pulley. Remove the drive roller. Remove the four screws found above each of the isolators. Using an Allen wrench, remove the four bolts found in each corner of the walking board. You will also need a crescent wrench. With two people, lift the walking board up and remove the walking belt. Replace the walking board and walking belt. Using your Allen wrench, replace the bolts in each of the four corners of the walking board. Screw the isolator screws back into place. Slide the drive roller into place. Walk the belt onto the pulley just as it was taken off. Replace the idler roller. Screw the idler bolts back in. Screw the side rails back on. Put the motor hood back on. Please refer to our videos titled Aligning the Walking Belt and Tensioning the Walking Belt for any help needed while adjusting your walking belt.